Uh, good afternoon, everyone. Thank you for coming. Uh, my name is Drew Luco. Uh, I am the director of Motor City Match and very happy to be here today to celebrate the opening of the 135th Motor City Match business, uh, Joyola May Salon. Uh, certainly an honor to be a part of such a wonderful project. Uh, and we would not be here today without the support of our city council uh, and our mayor, Mayor Mike Duggan. I will turn it over to you. All right. Well, let's give a big hand to Joy Lewis. How about this? The 135th Motor City Match Company to open in the city. And this was the vision that we have. Because Joy lives in the city, and we had this vision that folks from the city could get a little bit of help to start their own companies. You know, look at what's happened in this neighborhood. Lots of people moving in, and the question is, who's going to benefit? And we wanted Detroiters to be able to benefit. And so what you have done is our vision. You are going to build uh, your business. I know you're going to be very successful uh, in probably uh, one of the most rapidly growing districts uh, anywhere in the state of Michigan. And so uh, I wanted to be here and celebrate this. And with that, I'll introduce the council member from this district, council member Gabriela Santiago Romero. Hello everyone, good afternoon. Good afternoon everyone. <laughs> I am excited, it's an exciting day. I just wanna say thank you to Joy. Thank you so much for choosing to build in District 6. District 6 is a beautiful district, Detroit is a beautiful city. And we're coming back y'all, we never left. And investing in businesses like these bring me so much hope and so much joy to know that we are investing in women and women of color in this very specific niche. Curly hair is special, y'all. We do not have, we do not have enough businesses that center women of color, your hair, the, the, the products, the, the, the treatments, the care that is needed. So I'm excited. I am I am so excited, I'm so happy to continue to see these things happening in our city and in our district. Just wanna thank Joy so much for choosing to be here, for doing what you do. And I'm excited to continue to support. I already told her, whatever she needs, she can let us know. Um, just congratulations again. Congratulations to District 6 for having this business, this niche here in our community. And with that, I will turn it over now to our council president, Mary Sheffield. Thank you, good afternoon, everyone. Uh, had to be here just to support Joy. Uh, I knew Joy before she stepped into her entrepreneurial uh, role, and she actually served the city of Detroit. Uh, and so to see her step out uh, and pursue her dreams is such an inspiration to all of us, and especially me as a young African-American woman myself. And so, Joy, we want to pause uh, to lift you up on today, today uh, and present to you a Spirit of Detroit Award. Uh, because we believe you represent what the spirit of Detroit is all about. And as our former president will always say, the spirit of Detroit is not the statue that you see downtown, but is the spirit that you carry in your heart. And so we wanted to pause. And on behalf of the city of Detroit and city council, we want to present a spirit of Detroit award. And it reads that it is presented herewith as an expression of the gratitude and esteem of the citizens of Detroit to Joyola May Ceylon for your grand opening in recognition of exceptional achievement, outstanding leadership, and dedication to improving the quality of life. And it says that she believed that she can do it, so she did. And you did that, Joy. We appreciate you on behalf of the City Council, presented by my colleague and myself and the entire City Council. Award of recognition presented to Ms. Joelle Lewis, owner of Joella Mule Saloon's grant opening. And this is on behalf of the council members as well. Councilman Fred Durhall wanted to make sure that he shared this with his friends. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> for being here my name is joy <laughs> and let me fix this. 
So my name is Joy, and I am the brand new owner of Joy Olamay Salon. <laughs> And I am so full of love and just gratitude today to have my friends, my family, leadership in the city here today with me. Uh, I'm taking it all in. So I want to say thank you to our mayor, Mayor Duggan, to city council, uh, Santiago Romero. She's beautiful. I just met her today, but oh my gosh, she's made an impression on me. <laughs> And Council President Sheffield, uh, throughout the pandemic, she actually sought me out. <laughs> and she found me at Alta. <laughs> she came to the Macomb Wall and sat in my chair and allowed me to, you know, just love on her, love on her hair. Uh, and I just can't wait for her to come back so that we can get her curls popping. <laughs> but uh, really, I set out to open this business to empower um, people who have wavy, curly, coily textures to let them know that they're not alone in their journey, that there is somebody who um, has taken the time, the, pa the practice, the patience to master a skill to make sure that their hair is, you know, maintained from loose curls to protective styling, that they're um, able to have this accomplished with clean products, with ethical beauty standards, and with, you know, just so much thought and detail to make sure that they're cared for, that when they come into this space, they feel safe, they feel seen. Somebody has walked through the journey with them and will continue on that journey with them. Uh, so I am just, you know, I want to thank my friends, my family, everybody, my clients, you know, who have supported me, who showed up through the pandemic, who allowed me to open a business, take out business loans, open a storefront in a growing, huge major district in the middle of a pandemic and I just, I can't say enough. There's not enough words to, you know, to really just show the gratitude that I have to be here. And I just wanna grow <laughs> and I'm hoping you guys will grow with me. I hope that we'll be here uh, for a long time and that, you know, we can just continue to spread uh, love and joy and, you know, all of the care that goes into a business like, you know, your hair, your most vulnerable asset, right? <laughs> so, uh, all right, I'm, I'm here. I think I'm all set. <laughs> thank you, thank you.